bother us if we don't bother them. Did you do anything to this bee? No. We just wanted to play with a pinata. 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 <laughs> ah! And then, for no reason, a bee started chasing us. Bad, bad bee. Bees are not bad. Bees are amazing. Don't you know anything about bees? I know nothing. Hmm, I can fix that. Billy! <gasps> didn't you have a machine that can turn us all into bees? Machine! Perfect! This machine can turn us all into bees. For how long was it, Billy? Okay, cool. We have three minutes to see how incredible bees really are. <laughs> Look at me, I can fly. Wow, everything is so big. Check it out. We are worker bees. And that means we have a lot of work to do. Every day, we fly from flower to flower, collecting pollen and nectar. <laughs> the pollen tickles. <laughs> right. Bees carry pollen from one plant to the next plant. Flowers, fruits, and vegetables! Wow, that's a big job. Exactly! The bees do tons of work to help the planet and everyone who lives here. And then they all come back to the hive, which is their home. Behold the beehive! Inside the hive, they all serve the queen bee. Hello, your highness. Right. Then the bees take all the pollen and nectar they collected that day and turn it into honey! Wow, bees are so cool. They help us and they make delicious honey. Honey! Mmm, honey. Uh-oh, our time is almost up. We gotta get out of here before we turn into our real selves. We could destroy the hive! <laughs> We gotta go! Honey... Well, um... After just one more taste of honey... We are so sorry. <laughs> we never should have trapped you. <gasps> Wait! Elliot! Oh no! Elliot will break the hive! <gasps> Baby Bot B will save the hive! Be. I hope you will 
forgive us. Potato, potato, I love you, potato. You're the best thing in the world, my lovely, lovely potato. Rock in kitchen? No, 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 no. No! Potato! Why did you do that? No rock in the kitchen. Rock? This is a potato. And a very beautiful one. Beautiful? <laughs> rock. Don't listen to him, potato. You are wonderful. Can you believe him? He thinks this beautiful potato is a rock. Don't you know potatoes at all? I know nothing. Ah, of course. Forgot about that. Come, baby bot. No. I will take you to the amazing world of potatoes. <laughs> Potatoes are tubers. A tuber is a large type of underground stem where some plants gather and store the nutrients they need. You see now? It's a potato. Rock. What? No. Potatoes are not rocks. They are awesome! Listen up! There are more than 4,000 different kinds of potatoes. Check out the Yukon Gold, the Benji, the Cachellos. Some are tiny, some are big, some are purple, but never green. Potato! Rock! No, no! Look! They come from South America, and because they are so great, now people all over the world love them. You see now, they are potatoes. Rock. Potato. Rock. Potato. Rock. Potato, potato, potato. Rock, rock, rock. No. How can I explain it to this hard-headed robot? Oh, of course! I forgot to tell you the most important thing about potatoes. <laughs> they are delicious! Rock delicious? Oh, yes! They are the best food in the world. Let me show you. Mashed potatoes. Yucky! Spanish tortilla. <laughs> wow! I know. Potatoes. Potatoes. No rock. Elliot is right. I know. Potato good. My potato! Potato amazing! <laughs> potato, potato! Delicious! Great potato! And now, rock! And roll! Yeah. <laughs> 
Of course. You don't know about the water cycle? I know nothing. I do, but I just forgot. No, you don't. Yes, I do. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Enough. I'll teach you. But no arguing. Water never stops. The sun heats it up and turns it into water vapor. Up high in the sky, it cools down and becomes a cloud. And what does wind do to a cloud? Water never stops. Water drops in the cloud get bigger, then it rains. Water never stops. And it repeats again and again because... Water never stops! I guess you get it now. I know the water cycle. Now that you know what's happening, let's fill the pool. I don't want that water. What? I want my water. Ah! Oh no, my water's running away. Okay, Baby Bot, follow that cloud. Water? It's snow. It's too cold. We need heat to melt the snow. Then it'll become water again. Baby Bob, we need to go where it's warm. Down the hill. Come swim with us, Lisa. Me? In a baby pool? I'm a month older than you. I'm going to the cool pool. The grown 
una pooh. <risa> 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 To use the adult pool, you have to be this tall. <laughs> Hi, guys. <laughs> Is there room for one more? <laughs> of course! <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> I know nothing! Launching translation. Indeed, that is not a chicken bone. That would be ridiculous. What we have here is a dinosaur bone. Dinosaurs. Don't make stuff up. That's a chicken bone. I am not making stuff up. Don't you know anything about dinosaurs? I know nothing. I will show you. Millions of years ago, dinosaurs ruled the Earth. There were dinosaurs everywhere, in the land, sea, and sky. And they came in all sizes. All sizes? Like chicken sized? Well, actually, yes. Like this small <laughs> Comsognathus, the fastest dinosaur of all. Why was it running so fast? Probably running away from that. Hello! <laughs> the Tyrannosaurus Rex is the fiercest predator of all the dinosaurs. Predator what? Predator. It means that it can eat us. Don't be afraid. Not all dinosaurs were predators. This Titanosaurus, for example, is an herbivore. It eats plants. I like the Titanosaurus. Also, the Titanosaurus was the biggest dinosaur of all. It was as tall as four elephants. Chickens is that? Calculating. 32. As tall as 32 chickens. Enough about chickens. I am talking about dinosaurs. They don't have anything to do with chickens. They're dinosaurs. Dinosaurs. The word means terrible lizard because at first, People thought they belonged to the lizard family. But now we know that some of them were actually great, 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 great grandparents of today's birds. Birds? For 
example could be maybe a chicken. Yes, technically, they were birds, like chickens. Chicken bones. 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 Can I try some? Ew! Baby butt, that tastes terrible. Taste? Wait, you don't know about taste? Mm -mm. I know nothing! I'll show you! Welcome to the world of flavor. Our tasting menu today consists of sweet, sour, salty, bitter, and umami. <laughs> Let's begin. Get ready to try... Oh. Sweet. Sweetness is found in many desserts and fruit. It gives you lots of energy. Um, 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 um. Ah, sweet. The menu continues with sour. Sour is an exciting and fun flavor that could give you savers. Bon appetit. Um. <laughs> Then, moving on with... Salty! Salt is added to lots of foods to make them tastier. And also to make them last longer. No, no, sir! Not the tin, only the fish! Um. Salty. And now, bitter. You'll find the bitter taste in lots of vegetables. It could seem a bit strong at first, but once you get used to it, you'll love it. Bitter. This on the menu is the newest flavor. Umami. Umami is a velvety flavor that fills your mouth. Umami in Japanese means tasty. There are many umami foods. For example, mushrooms, carrots, chicken, asparagus, parmesan cheese, french fries, Seafood? <laughs> Did you like the experience? More flavors! Nope, there are no more flavors. What? No more flavors? No, sir. These are the five flavors. Sweet, sour, salty, bitter, and umami. Baby but no flavors! Creating Baby Bot Flavor! Uh. Try it, try it, try it, try it, try it, try it, try it! Try it. songs, activities, and podcasts on our YouTube channels, and the full interactive adventure in the Lingo Kids app. That was fun.
Let's fly!